What's up, the John Squad? And welcome to this Monday weekly episode of John's Thoughts, episode 99. Woo! Wow, we're on episode 99. Next week, next Monday, you know what that means? We're on episode 100. Wow, what a milestone. So let's get things going, shall we? Um, there's been a lot of firings during the week in sports so, uh, and other things, too. So let's get things going, shall we? Nebraska fires head coach Mike Riley. So i seen that coming in college football, so that was no surprise right there. Brett? Beeline fired after five after five seasons as coach of Arkansas. Apparently with Donald Trump. Donald Trump says I turned down Times Person of the Year. That's what Donald Trump says. Now apparently uh the Washington Wizards, what's going on with them? Let's see. Um let's see what's going on with them. Let's see. Washington Wizards rule out John Wall for two weeks due to left knee injury. Ouch. Gotta feel bad for John Wall, man. He just can't catch a break, but still, I don't want to get fun. He'll be back. So, John Wall will be back on the court soon. Another news out. Let's see. UCLA finalizes deal to make Chip Kelly head. Coach, that's good for UCLA. I can see that Chip Kelly will turn that team around for UCLA. That's going to be awesome. Arizona State fires head coach Todd Graham. Didn't see that coming at all, but now he got fired there. So Todd Graham is now officially fired. And in other news, uh, let's see what's going on here. Uh, Prince Harry to marry Meghan Markle. So that's pretty good right there. You never see that every day, but Prince Harry's going to be marrying Meghan, Meghan Markle. So that's pretty good for her. She's marrying a prince, and she's going to become a queen. So that's pretty good. Congratulations to them both. I have to applaud them right there. Just do a little bit of a applaud right there. On to the next one we have is uh, Florida hires Don Mullen as next... Football coach. That's good for them right there. You know what I mean? Florida gets a new coach, so that's pretty good. On the next one. Patriots Nate Emner reportedly out for the rest of the season. So that's on the New England Patriots. Now he's out for the rest of the season. Can't catch a break with him too, so now he's out for the rest of the season. So still that's pretty sad and all, but still he'll be back next season. So hopefully that'll be good. David Fidsdale. Fired by Memphis Grizzlies. Can't blame the Grizzlies because it started Marcus all being benched in the fourth quarter and things like that. So, um, that started how the way the team was going and stuff. So, can't blame them how the way they wanted to do it. So, can't blame them at all. And now, this is a funny one, too. This is definitely a funny one, huh? LeBron James ejected for first time in career against the Miami Heat. He got ejected, and I thought that was pretty hilarious. Uh, he gets ejected. Uh, LeBron James, you just make me laugh sometimes. But anyway, on to the next one. Uh, on to the last news of the day. Um, ESPN lays off 150 employees. Wow, now that is a lot of employees they lay off, 150, wow, that's a lot, so, that about does it here for John's Thoughts, episode, um, let's see, that about does it here for John's Thoughts, episode 99 in the books, next week, a spectacular number, 100, can't you believe that, the John Squad? Episode 100 next week. What a milestone I've been reaching here on these episodes. So, once again, the John Squad, slap a like if you're excited for episode 100. Leave your comments down below and subscribe for more. Peace out, the John Squad. Who's ready for episode 100 next Monday? Stay tuned and tap that bell on your little YouTube app so you never miss an upload and so you never miss episode 100.